Hello. Hello, Vogdot. Welcome to Earth. Thank you. Did you have a, a good uh, trip? Trip. Ah, yes. You describe the moving from location to location as trip. For us, it is not trip. It is phase. Okay, how was your phase? I cannot tell you. You see, during the transfer by hyperspace, consciousness is suspended. Oh, really? Yes. However, when one arrives at the destination, reconstituted and feeling normal, one can infer it was a good trip. I see. Well, okay. Well, I'm glad you seem to have had a good trip. Of course, I can't see what you looked like before you started. <laughs> yes, very humorous. Yes, yes, of course. Okay, uh, look, I thought we'd go for a drive. Uh, in this, what we call this a car, it's, a, it's a, a vehicle for moving from place to place. So you can, you know, have a look at the environment and see, see, see what, what things look like. Get a feel for the environment here. Yes, an excellent idea. Okay, let's go. Let's get going. Tell me, what are the objects on either side of that vehicle? Oh, that's uh, they're they're sort of phony uh, reindeer horns. Reindeer horn? Is it a form of navigation device? No, 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 no. It's it's uh, see see a reindeer is um an animal that lives in the uh, it's a deer a deer like animal that lives uh to, up towards the Arctic Circle. But this is the southern hemisphere in the summer. Yes, that's correct. You, you're wondering why there's a... Uh, okay, so it's the reindeer uh, represents a, a beast that pulls a, 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 a cart. You understand cart? Yes. Uh, which is driven by a man called Father Christmas who brings uh, gifts to children at this time on a particular day, which we're approaching rapidly, called Christmas Day. I don't think I understand. Okay. Um, right. So, so there's supposed to be. It's not really. It doesn't really exist, right? A, a man called Father Christmas, who supposedly originated in a holy person called Saint Nicholas, and he. Brings presents to children on Christmas Day, you know, and uh, he 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 flies through the air uh, in an anti gravitational device, which is a sleigh, and the reindeer somehow pull it through the air, and then he comes down to the houses, slides down the chimney, and leaves gifts at the bottom of trees, small trees in the house. It's very hard to follow the Earth culture, I think. Okay. So Christmas is a an occasion, annual occasion. Yes, annual occasion. Yes, twenty fifth of December. Mm -hmm. uh, and the meaning of Christmas is to give presents to children, well, other people as well. Mm -hmm. But no, no, that's not actually right. No, I beg your pardon. No, no, no. Christmas is actually about as a commemoration of the birth of a holy person, a, kind of a, a prophet, a religious teacher called called Jesus. Except he wasn't really called Jesus, he was called Yeshua, but we call him Jesus. Why do you call him by a different name to his real name? Oh, I don't know, I'd have to look up Wikipedia on that, sorry. So, the Christmas, uh, sorry, I'm trying to understand your culture. Yeah, that's fine, that's fine. Christmas is a commemoration of the birth of a holy person of importance. Correct, yeah. So, what is the connection between... The man who brings the presents on the anti-gravitational device and the holy man. Well, I actually hadn't thought about that. <laughs> That's a damn good question. Look, can I get back to you on that? <clears throat> of course. Um, 
And so he was born on the 25th of December, this holy person, yes. Well, no, he actually wasn't born on that date. He was, no one really knows when he was born, but it certainly wasn't in, 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 in December, which is, um, as I understand it, it was another date. So, you commemorate the birthday of this holy person, Yeshua, on a date which is not his birthday. That's correct, yes. And why do you do that? I think it's something to do with the civilization that um, the religion associated with this holy man, Yeshua, um, uh, took root in and developed in. It uh, was the Roman civilization. And, you know, they 25th of December was a big day for them because it's the solstice, you know, the sun is, um, you know, the solstice, you know what a solstice Yes, yes, I understand. I have studied this in preparation for coming to your planet. Right, so... So they just thought, well, what the hell, you know, we're doing the 25th anyway. Let's pretend that Yeshua was born today and we'll celebrate his birthday. Seemed, seemed a good idea at the time, I guess. Yes, yes, I think I see. <laughs> but I will look forward to further explanation after you have consulted uh, this thing you refer to as the Wikipedia. Yeah, sure. Listen, I got an idea. I'm going to take you to have something very special. We call it a hamburger. It's a kind of nutrition and, and Coca-Cola and stuff like that. Uh, what, do you, what do you reckon? We'll, we'll go and get some food and drink. Yes, I am happy to have new experiences and to become acclimatized to your rather unusual planet. <laughs> okay, let's go.